Hi guys, it's DJ here from Cozy RC. Welcome to part 2 of my mini mono build. In this video I'm going to show you how I epoxy seal the hull. We're going to install the drive system with the motor. We're also going to install the rudder with the servo, the speed controller including the water cooling. So let's go!
next build video, we are going to finish the mini mono. We are going to put flotation in the bow section. I'm also going to add trim tabs and turn fins on the transom. We are going to add the deck. And hopefully I can also run it in the next video. So stay tuned for that one. After finishing the mini mono, we are going to continue with my current other projects. First of all, I have to finish the T800 laser cut kit. I have to finish the complete build and show you how I do it. Also, I'm very excited about this project. This is a vintage F1 tunnel with an open cockpit. It's a Velden race hull. This boat competed also in the Netherlands. The driver is a Dutch guy. And my friend Jan, he knows the driver of this actual boat. He modeled it in 3D cut and he made a CNC cut kit from it. So I'm going to build it. Very excited about this one. The finished boat looks awesome. I will show you a picture right now. And another awesome project is this plug of a Twister 24 Swedish catamaran hull, which is milled also by my friend Jan. And I'm very excited to finish this plug, make it totally smooth. Then I'm going to put the mold on top of it. And from the mold, we're going to make a carbon fiber racing hull. It will have an outboard. So yeah, that will be a great project. Looking forward to that one. And guys, I want to say a huge thanks to all of you, all the nice comments and advices I get from my videos. So I really appreciate it. And also there are many of you who are now building either a wild thing or the GeForce Twin Mono. Some of you sent me some photos of your build and it looks absolutely awesome. So a shout out to all the DIY builders and I hope to see you all in the next video. Bye.